Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today is a little different. Um, if this is out, then we are evacuating for Hurricane Milton. We are heading up to Louisiana if we go. So if you're seeing this, then we evacuated. But if you're not, then guess we didn't. There have been... There has been a lot of weird stuff happening with storms in the Gulf lately. We already had Hurricane Helene. That came over, completely destroyed parts of Tallahassee. Even down here in Inglewood, there's sand two, three feet high. So if this Hurricane Milton goes up to a four and goes a little bit south towards Northport, where I live, then we will evacuate. So we've just been preparing. We have the shutters up. Well, a little bit of the shutters up. We'll finish that tomorrow. We are packing stuff. And uh, if we do evacuate, we will by tomorrow night. I'm gonna record every now and then and add to the video when we're preparing and just packing things for the trip. And this might draw out into a few different videos. Some videos in Louisiana, some after the hurricane. So yeah, I guess I'll see you then. Got some sandbags going. Uh, already got four over there. Got this one and this one, and that should be it. Our shutters are up. And yeah, so now we're in the preparation phase. This is the sky and it's supposed to hit in two days. So this is probably just a old storm that's probably gonna move out of here and head towards the main storm. It's gonna turn into a band. We now have a rainforest inside of our house. Those, all those plants were outside. Now we gotta bring them in to shield them from the hurricane. Shutters are up. I'm eating lunch and we still got to move some of the stuff from the lanai inside the house. So we are preparing to evacuate. Now we have everything moved inside the house. Shutters are up. We have the sand pit completely empty for all the sandbags by the doors. And this is just some overcast. It's not the hurricanes because the hurricanes will hit in two days. So I'll keep you updated on the evacuation. As you can see, the hurricane is in the Gulf of Mexico by the Yucatan Peninsula, and that huge band right here that I'm zooming in on is actually the, the clouds from earlier.
that I was pointing out. I told you it was going to be a band. There it is. Hey everyone, we finally made it to our destination for the hurricane. I got my little room they set up for me. Awesome. Thank you so much. I am so tired right now. I did not sleep at all in the car ride, so I'll catch you up when I wake up. Hi everyone, I just woke up. I slept from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m., but it was very good sleep. So it's time to get up. Um, the storm has gotten stronger. There, this meteorologist guy is saying it is getting to the maximum mathematical limit of the Earth's atmosphere and what it can produce. So that's kind of scary. Um, I'm glad we're out of the storm, though. Glad we're not in the path and I can get some videos for you guys. So, yeah. As you can see from what you just watched, the eye of this storm has become about a perfect circle. And this storm has become so organized that the eye has gotten so small, it went, it got down to 3.8 miles wide, the eye. That is so unbelievably tiny, you can only imagine the the power of the winds in the eye wall it's actually kind of scary got here and the cat and grandpa are here as well cats under the bed We've all got settled in, including Grandpa over there. Um, I think I'm gonna call it for this night. And uh, yeah, uh, please subscribe, like the video. I am going to post tomorrow about our adventures in New Orleans, possibly. But if not New Orleans, then I'll post about our adventures just in the general area. So yeah, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.